Looking where to stay in Positano, here is what my experience was like staying at the gorgeous Hotel Poseidon, a luxury hotel in the perfect location, family run with the most incredible views. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Look where I am, I am in Positano, Italy. I am so excited to be here. I've actually been here for the past five days. If you wanna check out my vlog of what I do in Positano, I will leave it here. But this video is very special because I am staying at Hotel Poseidon, a luxury hotel in Positano. And I wanna share with you my experience of what it's like staying here, what the views look like, what the room looks like, and everything that I get up to while I'm here. You could stay in this hotel and not leave and have an amazing experience. This hotel features a gorgeous just panoramic swimming pool, 50 rooms and suites, a restaurant and cocktail bar called Il Tridente, a beauty center, and a private garage. So if you're looking for somewhere special to stay in Positano, I highly recommend checking a hotel Poseidon. Me and Alcenio have been coming here for the past couple years to enjoy cocktails and dinner, but we have never stayed in the hotel. So today I'm going to be showing you around this gorgeous property and I will give you a sneak preview of this view. I, I can't believe it. It's incredible. You have a full view of the bay of Positano, and then you also have a view of Vespaccia Grande. What's special about Hotel Poseidon is that it's still family run from its beginning in 1950, where it started as a family vacation home. Since then, it's opened up its doors to tourists and has been expanding to what it is today. You can tell from the different floor tiles where the additions happened in the hotel, which is a really fun, cool feature. And the family who started Hotel Poseidon still lives here today. Many things have stayed the same since its beginnings, including the interior decor, red carpet, and iron rope railings. And a cool feature is the hotel's home to the first ever elevator in Positano, and it still looks the same. But don't be worried, it is still updated with modern mechanics. Uh, okay. See you there. Okay, ciao. Okay, we're going in the elevator. The first elevator in Positano. That's, what an amazing fact. And it's the same style. We are staying in a junior deluxe suite and has a huge private terrace. It's room number 36, if you're wondering. There are 50 rooms here. So just checked into our room. This is the bathroom. It has a toilet, <laughs> a bidet, and then it has this gorgeous blue tile. There I am. And there's also a bathtub and shower together, which is nice. So I'm definitely going to be taking a bath. And we have some robes. And they also have their own bath products. As this is what our room looks like. There is a king bed. And then there's just a seating area with a desk and a TV. But the best part is on this balcony. Let me show you. We have two doors that enter it with the most incredible view of Positano. So we have a very large balcony. We have two seating areas as well as some lounge chairs. It's like a million dollar view. And we just have a super large terrace to enjoy it from. And I don't even know where to sit because there is also the cocktail bar and pool down there with an amazing view as well and there's so many amazing places to look but this view is incredible we are now headed to the pool and all of the hallways are lined with like this red carpet it's really pretty and it's been here since the opening and like look at this handrail it's like a steel knot it's really really cool Oh. <laughs> All right, I was going to go in the water. Cool, and they have. Plenty of lounge chairs as well as cocktail tables for the view at night. The most stunning restaurant, I'll show you that later. But this is just incredible. And we're gonna go relax on the chair now. We are enjoying the pool. They also have, you can order drinks to the chair and just relax all day. It's an amazing option if you don't feel like going to the beach but having some water to refresh yourself in. So we are just taking in the view before we get ready for cocktails. Fresh shower. And I'm gonna be putting on the little slippers that come with the room and 
I'm ready now to enjoy the private balcony. They even have for men. <laughs> it is about to be sunset. And look at the sunset view. It's gonna be really nice. The shower pressure is so nice and warm. So I had an amazing shower and I'm in the Hotel Poseidon robe and my hair is drying, just getting ready for dinner. So we are all ready for aperitivo and dinner. We always get drinks at this hotel every single year that we come. So it's really awesome that we're staying overnight in the hotel. But for me, it's one of my favorite places in all of Positano to watch the sunset. It is a gorgeous view and the service is top notch and it's not as crazy as other bars in Positano. It's very much like a serene place to grab a drink and really enjoy the view. And actually, the, the past two times that I was here, we always ended our night at the Aperitivo Bar. So we're doing like tradition. It is our last night here in Positano, so we're going to enjoy the view. And then we are also going to Il Tridente, which is the hotel restaurant. It's covered in like gorgeous flowers and I never ate there before, but it's one of the top rated restaurants in Positano, so. And I'm wearing this Luisa Positano dress. I got it here in Positano. And if you watch my other vlog, I've been wearing it like all the time. Like I'm not gonna get out of it. It fits so perfect. So let's head off for Aperitivo. So we have arrived to our table for dinner. They also offer like light bites and snacks for a shared plate so you can have dinner here as well as just drink and you can take in literally the most iconic view of Positano it's like filled with all this greenery and flowers it's so pretty right now and we're just deciding what we want to drink <laughs> I don't know if I want a Negroni so we are going to see what we want so this comes with your cocktails and just like as a starter oh yes drink. look at that color so we have our Negronis Classic. Yes, yes. <laughs> we, we drink these in New York sometimes. And it brings us back to Italy. We always think, think of this specific restaurant, Definitely. cocktail bar. Because we always order this. Yeah, always we always order this drink here. Mm -hmm. we always yeah. come here for the last night. It's like round off our time in Positano. So I think it's like a hidden gem. Oh, yeah. There's no one here. Yeah, so it's very quiet. If you come to Positano, trust me, you will love this restaurant, bar. It's amazing. And everyone here who is working is just so nice. Yeah. So, cheers. cheers. <laughs> we then had a lovely dinner at Il Tridente underneath the flowers and watched the sunset. We started with the red prawns and tomatoes carpaccio and the zucchini flowers stuffed with ricotta cheese and basil. Wow, it was so good. Then we had the spaghetti with garlic, olive oil, sea orchid, and glasswort, and the broccoli gnocchi. And don't skip dessert. There were so many amazing options. We tried the chocolate cake and it was delicious. Ooh. We just came back home to the room from dinner and we have the turn down service. We even placed our little sandals like this. And a really cool feature is that if you find the bed uncomfortable, you wanna change the, your mattress, they will come in and change your mattress for you. So they usually recommend sleep on it, how you feel. If you want something else, they'll just come in and change your whole mattress setup, which is so cool. I do wanna see this view at night. The view at night. This is incredible. And just look at this view, it's so, I will never get over it. We had an amazing night at Hotel Poseidon and they do offer a breakfast buffet in where we had dinner last night. So we're gonna go grab a plate. I think it's like a pretty big buffet. Fine, I'm gonna have some coffee, maybe some orange juice. So let's head to breakfast. So we're having breakfast where we were sitting last night and we're gonna go ahead in to pick out what we want from the bit. The breakfast buffet features sweet and savory items such as healthy nuts and cereals, meats, cheeses, and the chef cooking eggs and pancakes. Plus there is the DIY Bloody Mary and mimosa desk. Grazie. Oh, you want a mimosa? No. <laughs> no. It's really early. 
also it's like Bloody Mary. Yeah. I was so hungry I forgot to video my food but I had an omelet which I was so happy for because it was the only egg dish I had in Italy and it was delicious. So we just finished breakfast and now we are headed out to our next destination on the Amalfi Coast. We are headed to Ravello. So if you want to check out what we do there, be sure to subscribe to my channel. Check out what we get up to in the Amalfi Coast. And we're just taking in this stunning view. One last time, our last morning in Positano. This is what you can expect when you are staying. You get amazing views, incredible service. The restaurant was actually I think my favorite place that I ate this trip. Food was really unique and everything is made in-house, homemade pastas, and it had like a different twist to your traditional meals in Italy. And then of course my favorite cocktail bar, I've been there so many times and I will still continue to come and enjoy this piece of paradise in Italy. Thank you so much for watching and be sure to subscribe to my channel to check out more of my Italy videos and as always I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye from Pusitano! Mm -hmm.